Hi fashion designer, it's been a while and I'm so excited to share with you how to make this beautiful bow clip. I've been seeing it almost everywhere I go and I fell in love with it. So if you want to know how it's done, stay tuned. So over here you're going to need a clip of your choice and I've cut a piece of fabric over here which is around 18 by 24 cm and I've got two pieces. And then over here I've got um, 14 by 42 centimeters and a small piece of cloth here which is around 5 cm by 10. So we're going to start by folding these two small pieces to make a bow. And I'm just going to pin, pin them right here on top and sew a straight stitch. And I'm going to do that with the other one right sides facing and sew a straight stitch. The next thing you want to do is to turn these two panels the correct side. I went ahead and I ironed them and I make sure that the center seam is right in the middle. I'm going to fold them into two like this, make sure that they overlap by one cm. And then I'm going to take the needle and the thread and just sew right in the middle. Now, once you were done doing this, I am going to pull my thread just like this so that it creates the gathers right in the middle and have that bow shape. And then once you're done, you just want to twist um, the thread around right on the center and then tie a knot. And there we go. This is how it looks. So you want to do the same thing also with the other panel piece. And then you have two bows. Now to create the tail of the bow, I'm going to take this piece that is 14 by 42 cm and I'm going to fold it in half. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fold here the triangle right on the corner and just create a marking. I'm going to fold the corner and just create a marking right here. Then I'm going to grab my ruler and just create a straight line. You want to do the same thing also onto the other side and then take it to the sewing machine. Now you're going to sew around the shape or on the shape and leave enough opening so that you can turn this panel the correct side. Now, once you're done doing that, I am going to just cut out some excess fabric right here on the side following that shape. Then when you're done doing that, you want to turn this panel the correct side. Now once you're done, this is how it will look. You want to take those two bows that you've made and then take your needle and your thread. Try to make sure that you attach these two or right here in the middle as you can see. And then try to connect these two right at the bottom or these three pieces right to the bottom. I'm going to also move my thread around these pieces so that they get attached. And then once I'm done, I am going to create a knot so that they don't fall apart. And there we go. It looks so cute so far. So now I'm going to take this small pieces, which is around five, four by 14 cm, and I'm going to fold it or sew it in half. Then I am going to wrap it around the bow, like just like this. I'm going to wrap it around the bow and then fold the raw edges or the rough edge. I prefer sewing this with the hand stitch. Some people might prefer gluing this down, but I want to hand stitch it. And I'm going to hand stitch this piece like this. And then I'm just going to move the seam right on the center, which is later going to be covered by the head pin. 
and this is how it turned out the final thing is to insert your head pin right in between the layers and this is how it looks at this point you would want to glue it down so that it doesn't come out as you wear this bolt clip and this is how it turned out i went ahead and i put it on my daughter's hair she looked so adorable if you liked this tutorial make sure you give it a thumbs up